Thanks. You got in uh, quite a bit of trouble a few times in high school, and I, I seem to remember one involving uh, the vice principal, Mr. Booker, uh, <laughs> who was a uh, who was a guy who used to play football for UVA. Uh, I think All-American even for I UVA. Know, it's hard to imagine. Yeah, and he ended up being the vice principal, and uh, you and he always didn't always see eye to eye. Is that correct? We really didn't. No, I didn't like the guy at all. I've I spent several um, days in his office. Yeah. Um, one time I didn't go to his office was when I was... Um, <laughs> I ended up actually drinking my own urine to prevent myself from having to go to his office again because I think that one would have ended in a 10-day suspension. <laughs> and a lot of people... No, let's, let's go back a little bit of this story. <laughs> yeah. And let's, uh, let's, let's, let's talk about what exactly went down. <laughs> A lot of people think I was crazy for doing such a thing, but they don't understand that if they were in the same situation, they would have probably done the same thing, or at least they would have wished that they had. Right, okay, so let's let's let people at home know exactly what had gone down. Um, you had gotten... Uh... You had gotten uh, something about a vase is all I really remember. Well, it was those little things that they put water in to, like, stick a stem of a rose in. Um, and these roses, they were going to sell them for some dance they had coming up or something like that and you know I was in horticulture class so we had to fill these things up and I took one of them went to the bathroom peed in it and I told somebody I was gonna do this and somebody else overheard me and told the teacher so when I came back you know the teachers like what's in there and like he was like I told him it was water and he was like well you know if it's water then just drink it and I refused to so he took me to the office and luckily Booker wasn't there and then he took me to a few other places and it ended up in um, MLC which is the place for in-school suspension and the lady there was like you know she said if it's not piss then drink it and I thought to myself you know I better just go ahead and drink this before all hell breaks loose and it was only like it was only like a little bit and I drank it and that was the end of that um, and the only thing left was a memory in people's minds. Now, <laughs> now, yeah, that still hasn't and, gone away. Now, now, in hindsight, do you think you made the right decision? Definitely. I definitely think I made the right decision. My whole life might have been different. I thought the school, the system was out to get me. <laughs> I'd already gotten in trouble once. Um, you know, I'd already gotten suspended like you know less than two weeks earlier, and obviously hadn't and learned an my lesson. In, from and that. An unrelated incident. Yeah, and an unrelated incident. Obviously, hadn't learned my lesson from that. And the system was just looking for a reason. I mean, um, there were. There were a lot of people who were way worse than I was, but I was a target of the administration. <laughs>